the house that Jack built. This is the domiciliary edifice erected by John. This is the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice erected by John. This is the rat who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the obnoxious vermin who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice erected by John. This is the cat who killed the rat who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the domesticated animal of the feline race who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice erected by John. This is the dog who worried the cat who killed the rat who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the sagacious skein of the canine species of brutality who aggravated the domesticated animal of the feline race who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice erected by John. This is the cow with the crumbly horn who tossed the dog right over the barn who worried the cat who killed the rat who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the graminivorous animal of the bovine race, who with elongated, corrugated protuberances, completely elevated atmospheric space, the sagacious skein of the canine species of brutality, who aggravated the domesticated animal of the feline race, who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin, who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice erected by John. This is the maiden, all forlorn, who milked the cow with the crumbly horn, who tossed the dog right over the barn, who worried the cat, who killed the rat, who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the damsel, solitary and secluded, who extracted the nutritious beverage from the graminivorous animal of the bovine race, who with elongated, corrugated protuberances, completely elevated into atmospheric space, the sagacious skein of the canine species of brutality, who aggravated the domesticated animal of the feline race, who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin, who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice directed by John. <laughs> this is the man all tattered and torn who kissed that maiden all forlorn, <laughs> who milked the cow with the crumbly horn, who tossed the dog right over the barn, who worried the cat, who killed the rat, who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the humble individual of scant and unseemly attire, who sought honey from the lips of the maiden, solitary and secluded, who extracted the nutritious beverage from the graminivorous animal of the bovine race, who with elongated, corrugated protuberances, completely elevated into atmospheric space the sagacious skein of the canine species of brutality, who aggravated the domesticated animal of the feline race, who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin, who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary and directed by John. This is the priest, all shaven and shorn, who married that man all tattered and torn to the maiden all forlorn, who milked the cow with the crumbly horn, who tossed the dog right over the barn, who worried the cat, who killed the rat, who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the ecclesiastical gentleman whose procranium was deprived of its harsh appendages and who united in the bonds of holy matrimony, matrimony that humble individual of scant and silly attire who sought honey from the lips of the maiden solitary and secluded, who extracted the nutritious beverage from the graminivorous animal of the bovine race, who with elongated, corrugated protuberances, completely elevated to atmospheric space, the sagacious skein of the canine species of brutality, who aggravated the domesticated animal of the feline race, who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin, who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domestic directed by John. This is the cock. Crowed early in the morn and waking the priest all shaven and shorn who married that man all tattered and torn to the maiden all forlorn who milked the cow with the crummy horn who tossed the dog right over the barn and worried the cat and killed the rat who ate the malt that lay in the house that Jack built. This is the colourful specimen of the cock a doodle doo tribe whose antecedents disseminated grain from cereal and who with shrill vociferation awakened from his matutinal slumber that he <laughs> ecclesiastical gentleman whose procranium was deprived of its hirsute appendages and who united the bonds of holy matrimony that humble individual of scant and seemly attire who, who sought honey from the lips of the maiden solitary and secluded <laughs> who extracted the nutritious beverage from the graminivorous animal of the bovine race and with elongated corrugated protuberances completely elevated into atmospheric space the sagacious skein of the canine species of brutality, who aggravated the domesticated animal of the feline race, who completely annihilated the obnoxious vermin, who masticated the fermented cereal that was deposited in the domiciliary edifice erected by John. <laughs> Thank you for your assistance. <laughs>